We are back again live at the command center of the JW Solar USA. Guys, this is what is happening right now. I'm getting all the system lined up. The white uh, plate you saw, you seen back there, is uh, well plumbed, well to the dot. See that? A line straight all the way. You will see all these bolts. This is where the inverter and the um, load center is gonna be hooked up. Guys, I just wanna show you, this is what is going on. Live here at the command center of the JW Solar U USA. And let's get to work and see how things gonna look like. Let me show you, stay tuned. Now I'm gonna be mounting the uh, inverter up there. Watch this and stay tuned. Well, this is what it is. The inverter is up, and uh, the hood is gonna be right up here, okay? On those external uh, bolts. Stay tuned. Subscribe and share. Okay, this is the uh, the hood, and see, built for ventilation. And it's gonna sit right up there and stay tuned now the hood is up you guys can see here so this one prevents like anything from falling in water or any other debris and dust if like what I said for water if your ceiling is leaking or whatever you had a system so it's not gonna just penetrate direct to the transformer up there and wrecked all the component so this is how it's mounted now we're gonna be attaching uh, I'm gonna show you how the uh, the box is going to be attached stay tuned for this well on the side here you will see two screws where they're gonna go that's gonna be on the AC side where you can connect uh, line one line two to connect to your device line one or line two for for 120 120 to give you 240 again line one line two out line one line two in line one line two out if you want to you can just do line one in and line one out it depends to your application you don't want to run for um, uh, a 240 well in my case it's already there and I'll probably just do this time. I'm going to make sure my 240 is already is going to be hooked up to the system. Live here, the command center of the JW Solar USA. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.